we now come back to the famous by now very familiar familiar reaction with which we have started and we keep on referring to we come back to that and and we know that here my zn is becoming is becoming zn 2 plus and the cu 2 plus here goes back here as cu okay and the overall reaction can be written as zn plus cu 2 plus this is the ionic form gives me zn2 plus at cu this is solid plus cu which is a solid okay now we'll see an interesting thing happening here that we sh we'll be able to find out the equilibrium constant from the nernst equation okay and that is one of the biggest applications of the the nernst equation okay or the emf of the cell fine so we are actually trying to find out the equilibrium constant the equilibrium constant from the Nernst equation, from the Nernst equation, from the Nernst equation. Now we have seen the moment we put it in, what happens and obviously there is a salt bridge. Let us not forget that. There is a salt bridge as well. Now what happens is as this reaction proceeds, the concentration of Zn2 plus increases and that of Cu2 plus decreases because Zn, more of Zn is getting formed into Zn2 plus and more of Cu2 plus is getting formed into Cu. So, so this concentration here goes down. And as the reaction progresses, as the reaction progresses. Now what happens? When you in the first go, you had applied the, you had put in this and you would have measured the potential difference. Then potential difference at t equal to 0 would have been 1.1 volt okay at the start of the reaction at the start of the reaction the emf is equal to 1.1 volt okay that is equal to 1.1 volt but that is at the start with the lapse of time as Zn2 plus increases and the concentration of Zn2 plus here. Okay. and the concentration of this decreases the EMF also decreases because at the end of the day try to understand it is the conversion of Zn into Zn2 plus that is leaving electrons here right 
and it is the it is the conversion of Cu2 plus into Cu which is taking up that electron, right? Now, if this process suppose suppose this becomes this becomes a bit too concentrated and this becomes becomes a very uh, th this becomes uh, a solution of very low concentration then that very process of electron transfer from this electron to that electrode that will stop right and the moment that stops the e that means the emf is going down as as the as the reaction progresses okay till so so the emf decreases till it becomes zero and the reaction and the reaction is said to have reached an equilibrium an equilibrium okay so the reaction has reached an equilibrium now let us try to understand we we write the the nurse equation so e cell is equal to e not cell minus 2.303 rt upon 2f log zn2 plus upon cu2 plus this is what my equation was right this is my nurse equation fine now at equilibrium at equilibrium E cell is equal to zero. Okay, so that is E cell log minus two point three zero three R T upon two F L N divided by concentration of that. Now, if I name this reaction one, then for reaction one, one, Zn, it is Zn two plus divided by Cu2 plus, which is the equilibrium constant. Okay. So from 2 and 3, we get from 2 and 3, we get. What do we get? This whole thing is Kc, so I am putting it in here, right? And, and I am taking this to this side, fine? Or, or let me do one step at a time. So, E cell not minus 2.303 RT upon 2F LN KC, right? You see how this KC got introduced into the Nernst equation, fine? Now, this gives me 2.303 RT upon 2F, 2F, sorry, sorry, I'm extremely sorry. I am sorry. They become log the moment you have this 2.303 there, right? So, so log Kc, so that upon 2F log Kc is equal to E cell naught. This is equal to 1.1 1 .1 volts. Okay. 
okay now we have seen the value of this is how much this is equal to 0 0.059 upon 2 log kc okay so log kc is equal to 2 gets multiplied so 2.2 .2, or i should say 1.1 into 2 upon 0 0.059 okay here when i say log i actually mean that the base is 10 and it is a property of log that if log b base a is equal to c then b will be equal to a to the power c okay it is a to the power c now let me do that calculation so 2.2 divided by 0 0.059 okay 2.2 divided by 0 0.059 so let us multiply it by 1000 this so it becomes 2200 upon 59 right so so it gives me gives me 179 here and and 6 7 no 7 won't go so So that gives me no seven zero no thirty five right fifty six okay thirty six point Six point nine. Okay, so this is twenty nine. So it is twenty nine and and four, right? So so it is two thirty six fifty four, right? So fine. It is it is thirty six point nine four. Thirty six point nine four okay thirty six point nine four or are we right? Yeah, twenty one forty one zero. That is correct. Thirty six point nine four. Yes. This is right, 36.94. Okay. And that gives me that gives me so 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 this is equal to log kc base 10 is equal to 36.94. Okay, and hence kc will be 10 to the power 36.94 okay now now that can be split into two this is equal to 10 to the power 0 0.94 into 10 to the power 36 
okay now 10 to the power 0.94 has to be calculated by a calculator hold on Okay, so so it is 10 to the power and, and I hope you, you got how I got this. Okay. This is actually 10 to the power 36 plus 0.94 and I have applied the, the rule of the exponent, right? So, so let me erase this. Let me erase this and try to get, so Kc I'm writing this here, I'm writing this here, Kc is equal to 10 to the power 0 0.94 into 10 to the power 36. Now that is equal to, that is equal to, that is equal to, that is equal to just a minute Just a minute, the setting has changed to binary, so hold on. Just a minute. 